Okay, guys, let me bring you into the wonderful world of carbs. Are carbs good or are they bad? There's a load of stuff online, on the internet, blogs, forums, even in books that I feel uh, is often not correct. A load of rubbish. Uh, yes, there's lots of nuances out there and you can kind of explain certain things in a certain way, but let's just, can I just bring you back down to earth? Carbohydrates, no carbs till marbs. You know, carbs make you fat. Um, you know, what are carbs? Let's, let's just get into it. So there's four types of carbs. Let's start with number one, simple carbs. This is white sugar, right? Uh, delicious and sweet. It's also any kind of non-refined sugar. So that's brown, you know, a lot of people think that brown sugar is better than white sugar. Well, guess what? It's exactly the same. I'm sorry, it's the same. And I'm sorry to tell you that includes honey, and beautiful maple syrups. I'm not saying don't have it. The thing about these sugars here is often they're riddled in processed foods. Now, the biggest single source of simple sugars, uh, or sugar in Britain in our kids and teenagers is actually sugary sweetened drinks, energy drinks, your cans of drink. We neck them and it doesn't sort of fill us up, so it's not really taking place of a meal. They're completely uh, devoid of any sort of nutritional value, so they're sort of empty calories, and there's a lot of calories in them, okay? That's why they're a problem. So let's go to complex carbohydrates here. Now that is, you might not believe, white bread, white rice, white pasta. Now, these are beautiful things. These are incredible things. Also, they're delicious. They're wonderful carriers of things, sources generally, or fillings. And the important thing about these carbs is what goes with them. We're on to the third type of carbohydrate. This is super whole grain complex carbohydrate. We've kept all of the nutritional value. It's all in there. Uh, and we've got in sort of like an 80 gram portion uh, dried or 125 gram portion cooked of carbohydrates, we've got seven grams of fiber in there, right? That's quite good. It's quite hard to get anywhere close to that in vegetable world. So whole grain rices and pastas and couscouses and brown breads and flours, they're really high in fiber. What I try and do is have quite a lot of this stuff uh, and I have sort of a fair amount of this stuff and some things are just better with this stuff and some things are just better with this stuff. So I kind of balance it up and hopefully get it right in the mix. The fourth carbohydrate, over here, root vegetables. We're talking swedes and turnips and parsnips and carrots and sweet potatoes and squash and pumpkins, minerals, vitamins and, and nutrients and they're just incredible. We love the veg, okay? So uh, we're bigging up the veg. It's about portion control. Don't have too much. But you know what, if you stick to sort of these areas, right? You can actually have quite a lot, right? One quarter to a third of any plate of food can be complex carbohydrates. Uh, and, 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 you know, that's great. So we're talking about, you know, some veggies, you know, some bread or noodles or pasta, you know, and then your protein and, and, and your veggies and your dairy. So don't be afraid of carbohydrates. There will be loads of comments after this video, by the way, and there'll be all sorts of kind of professors that aren't professors uh, that have read a couple of things online and then go, oh yeah, but the, the molecule structure of a carbohydrate gets broken down in the body and it becomes a sugar. Ah! Well, yeah, it does, but they're not all equal. We've said that, we've got nutrients here, we've got fiber here, which will be the next biggest thing in the next 10 years. It allows you to feel fuller for longer, but also be happy. Carbohydrates, absolutely, by me, nearly every single sane nutritionist in the world, doctors, scientists, professors, and the World Health Organization will say these types of complex carbohydrates are ace. Let's get the conversation going, and using this stuff with respect is beautiful. And most importantly, it will allow you to create some of the most numptious, gorgeous, delicious food on the planet. Okay, life without pasta, life without noodles, life without rice and bread, come on, really? Really? Anyway, that's it. Carbohydrates, they are good, but just know what they are, otherwise they can bite you up the ass. Bye-bye.